So by becoming a foundation trust, people will have the opportunity to help us shape services the way they would like to see them. We can't possibly know all the answers about our ambulance service, whether we are doing things correctly in terms of some of the things the public might need or want or wish to happen. Well, um, by becoming a member, and I, and I must say that membership is free, it doesn't cost you anything, <coughs> members have an opportunity, for example, to elect governors. The majority of those will be public governors. There will be some appointed governors and there will be some staff governors because, of course, becoming an FT is also important for our staff. It's important that they feel involved as well. So by electing some of the public governors, members can have a direct route into the governing council and that has a tremendous role in shaping the way forward. I know that there are lots of other foundation trusts about, but all our opinion polls show and our public surveys that the ambulance service in the North West has a very special place in people's hearts and I'm hoping that that will perhaps uh, encourage people to become members. Once we become a foundation trust, communicating with our members is going to be very, very important to us. It's not a question of sign up and forget all about it. We will regularly be in touch with members with newsletters, surveys, asking them for ideas. We have at the moment a group called Critical Friends. Uh, and they, they have a similar function at the moment in the pre-FT environment. They meet regularly, they give us their views on, on issues, and we see that will be the case with our members. The public can get involved now in a number of ways. <clears throat> We're out for consultation. This is a 12-week period where we are going out across the North West to engage with local authorities, with other health partners and with members of the public. Uh, there is a consultation document. We've tried to make this as attractive as we can. Uh, it's in plain English, it's easy to read and at the end of it there is a, a form, an opportunity for people to give us their views on what we have put forward in the document. So that is one way. Um, the other thing I would like to fully impress upon people is that it is true consultation. What is actually said in that feedback to us will help shape our final submission uh, in relation to becoming an FT. So it is really important, this is a marvellous opportunity for people to comment on what we have proposed and make a real difference.